Oh. Uh, Bantam Charles engine. Uh, just waiting to get put together to put in the bike. Full stop. Uh, you see all the goodies. Uh, it's uh, even down to the the camera, and we're going to try as well. Different, uh, but we like to try things that are different. So. Um, there you go. Um, okay. Um, later we'll do an edit on uh, VSA engines. Uh, I've got a selection now of um, gear change quadrants. One that's uh, too short, unfortunately, so it'll have to be turned into a uh, um, Cotswold with the uh, flat uh, timing cover. Um, I was going to do it anyway, but with the uh, quadrant we've got, it needs uh, makes it um, the only way forward with that. Um, the, this most of this stuff is for the this D engine, as you can see. Um, that um, has basically been put together. Um, with bits that I had left out after the other four or five builds and I thought why not just put it into an engine I had a decent set of cases and then uh, these are the ones that I modified uh, to put the V25 gear cluster in um, the Victor type gears um, I think that it's, there's a page on um, the website uh, as you can see how I did that with a mill, um, quite an easy operation, tricky, but um, never seen it done before, so um, there's the foster tank sitting there waiting for that to be did, done, and uh, what else have we got? Um, a quick, a quick tour into the living room where sitting at the moment is um, Tank Brutiella uh, the number five Mini Otter frame the first one done with the uh, um, Fluxer and as you can see the welds have turned out really good actually <laughs> my first attempt with the Fluxer and uh, I'm quite pleased with it um, needs getting built now of course um, cylinder head and barrel for the B25 project that's got to be finished before January the 25th um, oh, work about there did them a long time ago the candle six uh, uh, eldest is still got a few I've got some in the case um, and uh, the first swap poster otter uh, fr frame off of the jig that uh, needs building now we've got a sandblaster that uh, we can put the complete frame in I can uh, get on with that now um, engines are uh, virtually done for that and then uh, we come to the uh, Foster frame that I did Otter cheaper with the using uh, Tiger Cub subframe um, uh, what else we got? Uh, um, modified the uh, swinging arm um, slightly. Only uh, only a couple of couple of bits. That's a to uh, the maintain Tiger Cub swinging arm, the same as the Scott Ellis bike was originally. Um, anyway, there you go. There's a, a bit of a start, and uh, it's uh, it's something I can just put a short video together now I'm using uh, a movie that I didn't even know existed on the computer till I asked um, Lee yesterday um, um, what you will note that I've got a broad North Oxfordshire accent well I can't disguise that so <laughs> all the videos that I'm speaking on will have that same accent okay thank you and uh, press the button on the subscribe and give me a thumbs up and we'll do you some more okay thank you